Hi, this is Josh with Luther Brookdale Buick, Chevrolet, and GMC. Conveniently located on the corner of 694 and Brooklyn Boulevard here in Brooklyn Center, Minnesota. Or visit us online at brookdalechevy.com. Today, we're gonna highlight with you the 2019 Chevrolet Traverse. The package grouping is the red line, the trim level is the Premier. So this is our top of the line model without all features and benefits with a red line appearance package. As you look over the front of the 2019 Traverse, you're gonna recognize that it's got black emblems, black bow ties, black underskirting, black grills. That's all signifier of the red line edition. Coincidentally, we say red line, but it comes with black accents. I'll show you why it's a red line when we get around the side. Also, our Premier package is the only Traverse that comes with all new headlights. And our displays have got automatic IntelliBeam headlights. So they'll either dim or not without you having to switch that switch over or anything just as it adjusts and sees light in the front. The Traverse has been our number one selling full or, uh, eight passenger SUV now for two years. It's gotten all the best reviews from Motor Trend. It's a JD Initial Power Survey winner. Um, and the red line is just kind of one that's really gonna make it look cool too. As we come around the side panels of the vehicle, you're gonna notice you got the black mirror caps and then you got the signified red line Traverse badging, black outlays with the red inlays on all the Traverses. That's only on red line edition. Also, if you've seen, our Rally Sport Edition is a similar appearance with one level lower equipment, doesn't have any of the red accents on the badging, just has the black accents on the badging. Um, also new for 2019 is our Rally Sport and our Premier can come with the 3.6 liter V6 engine. That's one change from 2018 if you followed the units where the Rally Sport used to come with our two liter four cylinder turbocharged engine. Our 3.6 liter engine uh, paired with the all wheel drive platform for all of our models across the board, Premier, LT, LS, anything that's got the trailering equipment on it can tow up to 5,000 pounds. And I'll show you that trailering feature in just a minute. We are gonna pop the door open and show you a couple things on the inside. As I said, this is our Premier Edition, so you'll see some up-level stitching on your leather seats. You'll see full power passenger seats, full power driver seats, heated seats, cooled seats. So no matter what the conditions are outside, we are here in Minnesota at our location. Sometimes we need them both. Today it's 100, next week it could be 30. You might need to heat or cool the bottom and the back of your chair. Um, Bose Premium Audio Systems also in their Premier Edition. And the interior styling will all have specific stitching just with the Premier. Now, if you went with more of an LT grip package car, which is our second or our third level car, you wouldn't see quite the refinements that you'll see inside this car. SUV for that matter. As we open the back door, you'll notice that our back door is still much larger than our old body style before, but similar to our 2018 model. We've also advanced all of our seating surfaces in the rear to give you a better option to get into the third row. So uh, whether it's a Premier, whether it's an LT package, you get the smart side second row seat. That's a one handle grab and the seat will automatically collapse up into the front, allowing you to keep a uh, booster seat there, allowing you to keep a child seat there without having to remove it. Whereas in the past, you would have to remove that seat in order to access the back. And once again, it's really an effortless push to do that. Um, one, one of the nice features about Traverse, it only has right hand loading. So what I mean by that is that it, it's gonna have you as a client always make sure that your kids are getting in on this side of the vehicle versus that side of the vehicle with the seat functions, much safer than trying to load in the middle of the road, especially when you're in a parking lot situation. So as you see, we come around this back of the vehicle. This is an exclusive thing to Redline starting from the top all the way to the bottom. So all of our moldings and the way that this is designed, our black bow ties and our tail lights are designed just for Redline Edition. So there's no red or yellow or amber colors in our tail lights. It makes it a clean, nice finish with just white and then different bulbs on the inside. Also, you see the signifiers of all wheel drive and traverse all around. Yeah. With our Premier model, we're all one button push when it comes to the rear hatch. Just tap it, goes up automatically. You can use a remote to do it. You can use the button to do it. You can pinch the handle. You can do whatever you want. We have extra grab handles this year on the back for making it longer and automatic retracting headrests. So when you put your third row seat down, it's not gonna go into your second row seat because the headrest is gonna retract automatically. By giving you a little bit longer area, you can pull that back up. Another thing that we've added is storage beneath. So we've actually taken the, uh, um, the, uh, the, the spare tire and removed it all the way underneath the storage compartment so you have some all weather storage here. Hard plastic, come out, spray it out. You know, you go on a salmon fishing, throw some fish guts in there, you spray that out too, no big deal. So we're gonna pop this hatch back down, come back around. Now this is one of the special things about Redline. It is the only way to get this wheel package. Traverse has many different wheel packages starting at LT all the way up to the Premier. The regular Premier package wheel would be the same style wheel, except it would not have the black with the red accents on it. So you can start with a 17 inch wheel and work your way all the way up to the 20 inch wheel when it comes to this. We can do it in chrome, we can do it in black, we can do it in alloy. There's really the options are endless when it comes to the wheel. So 
As I open up this side, I want to show you the other functions of this chair. Um, so I showed you on the other side that we can smart slide this seat over. Um, with this seat, we can still slide it forward and backwards, or we can collapse it flat down if we need to. So everything in here can manipulate to however you're using it. If you're hauling plywood, flip them all down. Great. If you got nothing but kids, flip them all up. If you got nothing but family, flip them all up. If you got two kids, you got one thing, whatever you're going to do, we can manipulate this to be satisfactory what you're going to drive with. So. As we come to the driver's side of the vehicle, I want to highlight a few of the real key ingredients when it comes to uh, traverse. Um, so the driver system is set up much more simpler than what we've seen in the past. Less buttons, more functions. So we've got our driver's seat memory settings for the driver, so you can do whatever you want for setting of one, two, that'll work for mirrors, that'll work for seat position, that'll work for even our tilt telescoping steering wheel. Um, and then we also put the power rear hatch over on the driver's door as well. Um, so it's out of the center stack, simplifying more space in there, allowing for wireless charging. But I'll show you that when we get into the cabin. So how about we jump in and I'll show you a few more features inside. Now that we're inside the cabin of the vehicle, uh, I definitely want to touch base on all the incredible safety features that Traverse has to offer. So Traverse has both our forward collision alert, our rear cross traffic alert, our side blind zone alert, and many other safety features. So a forward collision means if you're going to come up on something too fast, it's going to notify you. If you're at a low enough speed, it's going to stop the vehicle automatically. It can recognize pedestrians. It has sonar in the back that actually can look down a parking way. So if I go to back up my vehicle and it senses a vehicle that I can't even see over 50 yards down in a parking lot, it will give me a notification on my uh, display screen to watch out for that. Safety first when Chevrolet, that's available in almost all models. So as we also look at what we have in the vehicle for safety, this, the camera systems nowadays are incredibly important. So I'm gonna highlight a few cameras that are brand new to Chevrolet. As you can notice, our rear vision camera is actually, mirror is actually a camera. You can either switch it from a mirror to a camera. There's a second display behind on the rear hatch that will display directly behind you. Why is this important? Let's see, you had boxes, kids, all that stuff stacked up to the top of the vehicle. You can still see clear view behind just like you had your, you know, doesn't have anything blocking your view. As we come down to the infotainment system, we have two more camera systems. A full surround view system that actually looks like it's shining from 20 yards above you in the vehicle. And then you can either position it to look forward or to look in the rear of the vehicle. All this is available to you as long as you're at five miles an hour or under. Your rear vision camera and your rear view mirror works 24 seven if you wish it to. So as we come down, the other features are on the vehicle. I talked about heated, cooled seats, dual climate control, set the temperature, forget it, thermostat in the house, all those other great things. But tech features are kind of cool too. So if you've got iPhone 10 or whatever, or Androids, all those things, it's wireless charging. You never have to have another wire again. All you do is set your phone there, it charges automatically, you see how mine's automatically charging, and the vehicle's not even running. That's what's so great about it. So if you step out of your vehicle, your phone's about to die, you gotta run into the store or something, set it right there, it's gonna charge right up as long as your phone's capable. We still have USB ports and things like that, however, it's not a necessity with the new modern age phones. So, other things, as we come over to the steering wheel, we have to have, to have a, uh, a heated steering wheel in Minnesota. If you don't live in Minnesota, you still might like to keep your hands warm every once in a while. I know my wife likes it a lot. So, and this is where we can adjust some of our safety features, both the gap and where our collision sensors are, how far we wanna travel, in between the car in front of us. I mean, this thing is darn close to autopilot. If it starts to sense that you're going out of the lines, it's actually gonna steer you back in automatically. You can't use it as autopilot, but heaven forbid you were to fall asleep or need some safety assist, it's all there for you. And last but certainly not least when it comes to Traverse is this is our first year since we had Trailblazer where we can disengage and engage our, our all-wheel drive system. Thank goodness, right? I know everybody's been asking for it to be able to shut off their all-wheel drive or turn on their all-wheel drive. So you can turn this into two-wheel drive mode, maximize your gas mileage, and four-wheel drive mode when you need it. You can also turn it to trailering mode and off-road mode if you're really gonna get wild with your Traverse. Might use it if you're out ice fishing or something like that if you need a little bit extra traction. Now, also, when you get to the back cabin, as you see where the camera's headed, we have the second row skylight. So that's the second sunroof inside the vehicle. It has a shade on it for, to, develop, to prevent any glares, but it does really open up the back of the vehicle when it comes to your passengers. All these features are available in Premier. There's even a couple more things in the High Country Edition that we can talk about. And even in our lower grade models, you'd be surprised with what you can get. If you have any other questions, don't hesitate to call 763-222-1800 or brookdalechevy.com. Thanks. <laughs>